Hello, hello, and welcome back to another music reaction with me, your host, Rachel. I'm an avid music lover, Twitch streamer, and singer, and today we are listening to some more of Avenged Sevenfold. This was uh, recommended to me before I listened to fiction. So this is A Little Piece of Heaven. This is the live at the LBC. Um, this is the full entire concert, as you can probably see down here. So I jumped right to the part that is A Little Piece of Heaven. So we are going to jump right into this. Making the mist on their own. <laughs> Before the story begins, is it such a sin for me to take what's mine until the end of time? <laughs> Oh my god. It <laughs> sounds so evil. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Is that what I I heard correctly? Um You had the chitty chitty bang bang when she was sleeping. That's um not consensual, and uh, it's big bad. So I'm I'm thinking I'm thinking this song is about a villain. Also, the demon voices probably has a little bit of a clue to that. M Shadows is just having fun with the, <laughs> the vocals on this. Well, I mean, both of them are in him, him and Rep. Okay, okay. Oh my 
my god. Okay, wait. Um So the chorus or that little part that um the part where Rev sings and his like evil Makai Makai Words, man. What is wrong with me and words? Um I don't know how to say it properly, and I could sit here and fumble with it, but I'm not going to. Um, but his little evil voice, it's so that's the woman who came back from the grave and then went to the guy and was like eating his heart out and ripped out his eyeballs and is smiling while she's doing it. Is what I'm assuming. Those lines are her lines. Which I mean, she came back for vengeance. <laughs> okay. And then I guess now he's saying he saw the error of his ways and he's going to come back and apologize. But she's already dead. So how? What? What? Anyways, the song so far is like very, um, like audibly fun in terms of how they're playing with their voices and making them kind of like sound different and then going back to their kind of more regular voice. And then even just the way that the song itself is arranged, it's all um, kind of like it jumps back and forth. And even like they change the lighting and everything. Like every time the woman is talking about like gouging his heart out or whatever, all the lights are red. Um, this is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's like, it's like a... It's more of a story than necessarily like a emotional. It's not, it's more of a story story rather than an emotional story. And well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> Literally. Just having fun. His vocals are so pretty. I feel like something sinister is coming. His vocals. What is happening? Does it? Did he just? I was wondering what he was doing. 
doing? He was like patting his thigh. And then, what did you just do? Oh my god. I love it how he says sometimes or sings it. Okay, it. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Um, like I think I have an idea of what exactly. Well, what they were talking about, um, but for a lot of, cra okay, so first a man murders his girlfriend. Because he loves her to death and ex is extremely scared of losing her. He allowed his fear to overcome him. He describes his murder and justifies it. Then he eats parts of her and... Oh. So she wasn't sleeping. She was dead when he did the bad thing to her. Then the girl's soul comes back from the dead for vengeance. She kills the boy and eats his heart. I mean, he did kill and do bad things to you. So, I mean, vengeance is kind of expected. He uh, soon understands what a terrible mistake he has made and asks the girlfriend for a second chance, which he has begged for for a while. She grants him to get married and start killing others. So, after all of that, she still gets married to him, but now they're both dead, and they just go on a rampage. I mean, let's, okay, let's put the story aside for a second. The vocals as you heard me say throughout the entire freaking video. I love his- I love M. Shadow's vocals. I'm saying it with clapping my hand for punctuation. Because they're so freaking clear and, and like just raw and um, there's so much range with him. Like he just um, is able to change gears so smoothly. Um, and then, of course, Rev. Sweet, sweet Rev. Um, he had a lot of fun in this one because he just became like this. His voice like a, like just changed into this like demon voice. But like a, not what you would think a demon voice would be would be like low. But it was like a higher pitched one. Um, and that was a lot of fun. And then the freaking guy in the guitar and he does like the hand gesture and i was like oh my god and he does it every time and the cameraman is like oh we gotta catch this let's move this over here <laughs> oh my gosh yeah there was a lot in this video um and then the gentleman with the red uh blazer he did like the the marrying vow part which was very fun um do you take this woman to be your wife 
<laughs> I do. Do you take this man to be your husband? I do. Now you are man and wife. I didn't need to recite that for you. I'm a little crazy in the brain, apparently, after this song. It's contagious. <laughs> um, but that was really cool and uh, interesting, um, I guess, the, the fact that they came up with a story for a song um, is always interesting because you kind of have to have a middle, uh, like a beginning, a middle and an end for every story you tell. Um, but to tell it in musical form is always uh, interesting to hear because they do change the sound of it a lot like it's not just like a regular kind of like you start the song you reach the peak and you go down like it's kind of like all of like you you have to punctuate each section of the story with um different things and so it's interesting to um write a song that is a story and then come up with how you want to deliver it and how you want to play with it in terms of like vocals or um, musically with instruments and such. So thank you for recommending this. Um, glad to see the Rev again. It was bittersweet. Um, just reminds me and I'm like... <laughs> It's sad, but it's also good to see them all together and enjoying themselves and performing. Um, so thank you all for being here. Thanks for listening with me. If you liked it, hit the like button, hit the subscribe if you want to see more. And if you want to hang out with me in the Twitch fam, there will be a link posted down below. Thank you all very much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!